Okay, I told you earlier we had a little magic to bring um, Chet Laney into the banquet tonight. Chet is, is doing well. He's living in Topeka, Kansas, and uh, just could not make the trip here tonight. But Chet was a, a fabulous Ambridge Bridger. As a matter of fact, he spent about 17 years in Ambridge, and he spent the last, I don't know, 70 or so years in in Kansas, where he lives now, and he really made a name for himself there. He's a World War II vet, graduate of the University of Kansas, a teacher, a coach, an administrator, and one of the top officials in NCAA football in this country way back in the set in the 60s and 70s and, and for many, many years. As a matter of fact, Chet is with us technically tonight. Thank you, Chris. I started back in Ambridge under Mo Rubenstein. He got me to do a little officiating in the inner rules there at Ambridge High. And when I was in that service, I did a couple of games on the base. And then after I graduated from KU, I got a, a job as a teacher and a coach here in Topeka. And I started officiating real small kids. And I stayed in officiating ever since. And uh, I'm glad I did because I worked in the game of the century, uh, Oklahoma, Nebraska. And I worked in about six, seven bowl games. And I just had a history of uh, officiating. I probably officiated 3,000 high school basketball games in my lifetime. I've been indoctrinated into the Kansas Hall of Fame in officiating basketball and also in, in Topeka's Hall of Fame in basketball. And I enjoyed it. I worked a lot of ball games. I worked one game that was played in the Orange Bowl game. Nebraska was playing Alabama. And at that time, Bill O'Brien, Nebraska beat him 36 to 6. In officiating, I think I worked in every part of the country, from the West Coast to the East Coast, North and South. I worked all over, and I really enjoyed it. In Ambridge, uh, I was just always involved in uh, uh, either baseball or swimming or I learned how to swim in the Ohio River down by the Ambridge Bridge. I was a lifeguard there at the big pool that they built right up on top of that hill. Those years went real fast and uh, been married to a girl that went to school with at Ambridge High. We've been married now for, I think, 66 years. I sure appreciate it. Talking to you. Thank you, Chris. Chad Laney.